hello everyone welcome back to my unity open world tutorial series so in this episode i'm going to address few problems and improve my vault mechanism i started implementing in last time so this time this character can jump properly like this so now as you can see the character hand is in proper position and also no matter what the uh, direction my character enters the world he's in proper direction facing away from the world when he lands like this and yeah those are the two things i'm going to cover today and this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me okay this is what we worked on last time the character can jump and vault over this wall so let's continue from that point okay so now the problem is uh, yeah this still this has a lot of problems so first one is if I enter this wall with an angle so this is what happens so we need to rotate this character to match the vault action so to do that let's go to the character movement script and in this vault action we yeah we only move the character towards the desired location but the, we don't rotate it so let's see so we need to rotate that in order to properly align the character uh, with the action so how to do that but uh, this uh, rotation part uh, should happen simultaneously with the do move part so appending it to this sequence will not uh, get it done so instead what we should do is sq dot join yeah. transform do rotate so yeah we should rotate to which uh, so what's the rotation so i think we should have the rotation same as the landing point so t land point dot rotation the reason to get a landing point instead of time should be same as the move yeah why do we have an error to rotate with error oh wait why do we get an error here all right the rotation is a vector not a quaternion So how do we get it? All right, I think that should work. Jola angles. Okay, so what I was saying is the reason to get the rotation of the landing point instead of um, the jumping point, uh, the wall point, is because uh, I in future I'm gonna need this character to jump from vault from this side to the other side as well so to do that we gonna have we need to have another landing position on the other side as well so yeah that's why okay so with that said um, right let's see if that works
okay I think we need to rotate the landing position this shows the local yeah uh, the forward of the landing position should be the other way like this yeah okay now let's try Now, if I enter the vault with a rotation like this, oh, nothing happened. It's not working. Well, let's see if some rotation change happens actually in the player character while doing the world action oh, okay so actually rotation happens only in the character mesh not on the character it's a uh, root itself so if I do a jump like this well actually the rotation change happens but it's not affected to the mesh rotation see okay so then instead of the main transform let's transform T mesh and then let's see uh, what we need happens okay I think character rotated to the desired side let's look at this way and jump right it worked now what we should fix does the animation place correctly let's see no the hand placing position is wrong so let's fix it so let's try to find what is the best place to place the hand so to do that maybe yeah let's time to time scale let's slow down the time a little bit so that we can clearly see what's going on same position is wrong all right so let's try that again and try to find out the best position let's go to the C I can't see that right now the hand should be well we should have stopped the animation a little bit earlier
character was too fast. Okay, now this is the place. The character should be forward in some forward position should be more into the here so that means now the current is it location is minus 2.9 oh sorry we should check it in global yeah a minus 10 it's now so we should move it like minus 9.7 previously it was minus 10.35 uh, the difference is let's see uh, uh, 9.7 to 10.35 so that means different is 0.6 approximately 0.6 and the forward so what's the jump position here it's actually here okay then let's move it point six forward that means minus 1.9 is that it did I was my calculation wrong uh, let's just see yeah it should be more in okay then let's place it inside the pool like this and also let's use another color to clearly see the voltable wall No, let's see. Do we have any other color? Okay, let's use this. Okay, I think it worked. Let's check again. What's happening here? Okay, I think that worked. Yeah, hand position is correct. Now let's remove uh, this time scale slowing down part and check again. Yeah, that's better. Now we can't jump from the other side because we haven't set up that party yet. 
okay better and i'll stop this episode at this point and in the next episode i'll work on uh, making this character able to jump from both sides that means he should be able to jump from this side and also from this side so if you like to support my work you can get the membership of my patron club link would be in the description below and thanks for watching see you in the next episode goodbye